giver. Amen. Would you stand and uh, also share an expression? Bless you, Janice. I'm sorry. <laughs> she did like clean. She did like clean bread. So yeah. you'll, you'll notice that all in the family, we have borrowed brooches from her, and we all have that. So she loves sparkly things. That's why she's so excited about being in heaven with the streets of gold. And you know, we had. Um, I'm a teenager. Um, we had a mom and I talked about heaven and and what it was going to be like. Because sometimes, to a child or teenager. Heaven can be kind of an abstract, vague concept, and so we had this great conversation, and she says, you know, Julie, it's going to be like all of us here at the lake. You know, none of us have to go to work. We'll just sit around, enjoy each other, you know, and she says, it's just going to be just, just like that. And so um, what I didn't realize is that it's what I told my children, and my daughter Katrina couldn't make it. She's in Germany, and my son Jeremy's in Afghanistan, but... Um, Katrina um, said, Mom, do you remember when I was little and you told me that uh, heaven was going to be like being at the lake? And it's like, that's right. And I, and I told her, that's, that's Grandma. She, that's what she said. So I, I can't help but thinking that, that right now, you know, in heaven there's this big lake, the big Lost Island Lake, that there's mansions all around it, and she's just, you know, setting the table, and this lake is clear, never turns green, <laughs> never freezes over, and, and she is there, she is recruiting Dan Wagner, and Howard Martha Tiller, and those that have gone on before us, and she's, she's getting them all to sing in a choir, and she's waiting for all of us to join her, and, you know, I just, I want to express my appreciation for the support we've had um, as, on behalf of my family, the love and everything is, has just been a comfort and just beyond words. So thank you so much.